Hello, everybody. It's time for the second game of the today's in the meantime. Well, Merry Christmas, Hanukkah, or Boxing Day viewers, depending on what you celebrate. And this is a wonderful time of the year. Welcome back, everybody, to the Failboat YouTube channel. Music presented to you today by Rare Train. Not, ever, not all of the music, but <laughs> the music that you just heard. Welcome, everybody, to the Pokemon Ultra Moon Nuzlocke. In the last episode, we have beaten the Grass Trial and do some, uh, to, uh, to, do, do some unfortunate plays. We have lost Fub and Kipo. It's it's real. It's actual sad boys. But we're moving forward. We're moving beyond it, and we gotta keep. We gotta keep strong for them. For them, we have to be strong. So that way we can continue on and live as one. Hold on. <laughs> one second. Hold on. Also, apparently, sorry. I'm uh, so so for the people who are watching this live, this will make sense. For the people watching, for the people. Okay, hold on. For the people who are just watching Pokemon, this is about to make no sense. But oh my gosh, this apparently exists. Again, for the people watching this live, this is going this is going to make sense. For the people that are just watching this Pokemon episode as a standalone thing. This will make no sense what I'm about to show up. What I'm about to pull up on screen. But someone has indeed done it. I don't believe this was done for the purpose of the stream. But someone has drawn art of Ganon with Hermione. Not in any sort of a shipping way. But it exists on the internet. The internet is a weird place. I'm just gonna be dead honest. This internet is a weird place. If you're watching this stream, apparently it's an extra weird place. Because I just showed that off. Anyway, that does happen to exist. That being said. That being said. Thank you, all tribe, for that beautiful source material. <laughs> Sorry, I just saw that I just saw that message and was like, oh no. Hold on. Bam. Okay, now we're in it. Now sorry, I just had to tend to something real fast. Now we're actually in it. So in the last episode, we lost Fubu and Kipo. Now, we got Booyah and Camel on the team. Because we got to take down the rock trial. Or at least the rock the rock leader person, right? Now, today, we're going to be doing some leveling. I'm just going to let you guys know straight up. This is going to be pretty much a leveling, catching back up thing. <clears throat> Daniel, did you see the latest Pokemon Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon trailer? No, but boy howdy did I love how they spoiled it in the thumbnail. So fun fact, uh, if you guys don't want to get spoiled on the a Pokemon game, don't ever subscribe to the official Pokemon YouTube channel. Don't ever do that, because apparently, you know, they might just post spoilers in your, in your YouTube sub box. Isn't that great? Wow! Thanks, Pokemon YouTube channel. Official Pokemon YouTube channel. For just, you know, spoiling the, the, the main enemy of the game. You know, at not even that long after release. Really appreciate that. Really appreciate that. <sighs> Anyways, I will admit it looks cool, so I'm, I'm looking forward. What new Pokemon do you need? Right now... We're going to be rocking Booyah and Camel. Right now, we're going to be rocking Booyah and Camel. Um, JoJo needs a little bit of leveling. Black Friday needs a little bit of leveling. But mainly, I'm focused on on, on, um, on Booyah and Camel. And then, actually, we we can... Oh, 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 uh, you, you need picks, right. Uh, we need a Tentacool and a Horse. Send me, send me a PNG of a horse. <laughs> Actually, never mind. I think I have a PNG of a horse. Hold on. Wait, is this? Yeah, this is correct. Hold on. Let me just. <laughs> Hold on one second. I think I can just like. Do, do I just have a PNG of a horse? I do have a PNG of a horse. <laughs> there we go. There we go. 
Oh, that's beautiful. I'll just leave it like that. This is good, right? Good overlay. <laughs> 10 out of 10. <laughs> Nay! There we go. There we go. What we can do? Let's take you and crop you behind there. Perfect. Now we're going to put you behind Nick. There we go. This will be Camel's picture. <laughs> it's the real horse. There we go. Just tuck that neatly there. It's going to tuck that neatly there. And then we're just going to take the next image Taylor sends. Here we go. Tentacool. Bam. Save. Now I'll, I'll actually put up a tentacle image. Hold on. Um, let me at least like enter into a battle with one hand while saving this image with the other one. There we go. Go over here. This image. Change it out for a tentacle. Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> Dude, what is this duo? This is such a weird... I have too many tabs open. I have so many tabs open. I can't even find the chat again. I've lost the chat. Hold on. I've lost you guys. Where are you? I found you. There we go. Now I can see you all again. <laughs> this is the ultra real horse in chat. It's perfect, man. I hope the horse stomps on your grave, fail boat. Fail boot. The kicker in that is that you call me fail boot. That's how you know the comment was high quality. All right. <laughs> Nay. So what do I want to do now? What do I want? I, I kind of want to explore a little bit. I don't want to grind in the same area forever. I don't want to grind in the same area forever. I want to move on a little bit, which I believe I can do by going downwards. We have a nice team of three. <laughs> Yo, once, once we get, um, once we get good old, um, Jojo evolved, then things start to move forward. Once we get Jojo evolved, then things start to move forward. Because right now, Jojo can barely fight on their own. We essentially, right now, are playing with a team of three Pokemon. Which is very scary. Nick and Bumpalid are the parents of this group. Actually, I'm sorry. I didn't do my recap that I normally do. Excuse me. I need, I need to do my quick little recap, otherwise I feel bad. First of all, we got Nick. Holding that Citrus Berry, rocking that Intimidate, and ready to bite down with that Crunch. Naughty in thought, or like, naughty thoughts, or rather, nature is naughty, likes to thrash about, that is Nick. Then, we got Black Friday, hasty, alert to sounds, JoJo's stand. Then we got Bumpalid, the partner to Nick, the teammate to Nick. Bashful, proud of its power, our Mr. Mime, holding a citrus berry as well. Then we have Jojo, the stand user, the wielder of Black Friday, hardy and mischievous, our special Pokemon that if they faint remains alive within the box, unless we roll, uh, or, uh, until we roll correctly. However, until we roll them correctly, like a dice thing correctly, we cannot bring them back. We got Booyah. A new addition to the team. High special attack because of that mild nature. Likes to relax. A new member indeed, who I hope to see a lot from. And we got Camel. Serious. Likes to run. Got a lot of stamina. And plus, a pretty good attack for being just straight up level 18. I'm eager to see what they got. Also, JoJo is actually not the worst attack, given how they are a baby Pokemon. I want to see... Dude, wow. Wow. Look at JoJo's HP. Look at JoJo's HP. That is, like, remarkably higher than I expected it to be. Huh. <laughs> JoJo is tank. What? That's okay. That's okay. We move on. Yes, unfortunately, Fub and Kipo died during the, um... During the grass trial. I played it a little bit too risky. I played it a little bit too risky. And that and that unfortunately was the fault of my own. That is indeed a JoJo reference. 
<laughs> JoJo and Black Friday are just a big old JoJo reference. So again, I believe I, I progressed by going down right now. So I'll just keep going like that. And right now, you know what? While we're walking through the low, like 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 the weak areas, quote unquote, we should actually have JoJo up front. Because right now, JoJo's evolution, it needs to happen. It needs to happen. Also, Taylo or anyone else in chat, could you guys tell me, um, when do I get a Moonstone in this game? And hopefully it's sooner than rather than later. Because, uh, we need JoJo to get fully powered up. We need that Wigglytuff. Ace app. Oh, no! Let me change Pokemon order, please! Please, Hal, let me change Pokemon order. Don't do this to me. Oh, he, he descends from the top of the doll. It's, it's an angle like battling. You yeah, enter the research lab. I'll catch you there later. <gasps> He's gone. He's gone. We've been permitted life. We should actually not have JoJo up front unless we are in tall grass. We have been permitted life. However, we are getting closer to the new area. To, like, the Dimensional Research Lab or whatever it's called. So we need to be able to make sure to, uh, be alert in case anything kicks off here. I don't know what could kick off. But look, it's Pokemon. At any time, I could just walk into a new area and it's like, oh, well, cutscene that ends all of your team's life. Actually, I forgot, what are we doing? Hold on. First of all. We're going the correct way? I did not mean to fly. Well, guess we're going to have a cutscene real fast. I meant to zoom in. I just love Camel in, the <laughs> in, in my little roster down there. Just looking. All right, all right. Well, now that we've had a successful landing, here we go. All right, talk to me. Talk to me. Road on decks. Road on decks. Stop talking. I want to see the map. Thank you. Goodness. All right, um, okay, we're going down that way. Understood. Down to the left. Can do, can do. Woo! <laughs> Just run over a cliff. Taurus breaks their legs. It's like, I'm sorry. Admittedly, that was on me. Bam. Wrote on deck, stop talking. It, look. Look. It's like, oh, 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 jeez. She just stopped my bull. She just put out her hand. Just grab the horn. It's like, you will halt. Also, she just did a JoJo pose. <laughs> she just did a little bit of a JoJo insert there. Hey, Oricorio. All right, all right. Go JoJo Rio. That's not JoJo. It's actually Bumpelid. Never mind. You baited. Feel baited. Bumpelid. Give it to me. The the, the super powered Psybeam. I'm waiting for, for Nick and Nick and Bumpelid to just destroy this entire game. Now, oh, that's right, it's psychic type now. I forgot about that. How it, I I didn't forget its type changes. I just forgot. I thought this was fairy type. I thought this was it was fairy typing. Or maybe it is fairy typing. Frankly, I don't know. <laughs> Frankly, I do not know. My Oracorio was of the fire variety usually. Also the yellow, the electricity variety for a little bit too. Yeah, well, here we go. Get some levels. That's what we need. I <laughs> love little hands. Attention to detail. 10 out of 10. Alright, alright. Now, we continue down a little bit more. Oh, uh, yeah, we should definitely keep Bumple it up first. Definitely keep Bumple it up first. Because I'm imagining... <sighs> That's right! <laughs> Go, Nebby! Use... Use Splash! <laughs> <laughs> I was just acting like I was failure. Oh, Lily, you don't need to act like a failure. You're already our one. I'm sorry. That's way too rude. The joke was that my name is... Anyway, we're just going to move on past this br briefly before the chat starts yelling at me. Anyway, you you always seem to end up getting hurt, Nebby. Seeing that pain me just as much as I... Bleh, just as much as if I was the one being hurt. Sorry, I cannot speak today. But if I could become a trainer as strong as how and failure are... Failure, failure, oh, she's just saying that, she's not saying that twice. Then maybe things would be different. <laughs> I would probably still die! I mean, pew! 
Oh! Ah! <laughs> you splash! Oh, um, oh, failure. Hel hello. You, you didn't hear any of that, did you? No? Okay. I feel like it's been a while since we last met. Th there's a laboratory that studies the dimensions. D did you know? <laughs> Sounds like a weird, how's the weather going conversation. Did you know that this is a building that studies dimensions? <laughs> it's like, what? I mean, that's actually pretty metal, but, um, how, how are your trials? It must be quite trying to do three in a row. <laughs> More like trialing, am I right? <laughs> I have lost many lives. Goodness, really? It wasn't any trouble for you to, to tackle all three of Akala Island's trials? I'm, I've lost many friends <laughs> along the way. I love how Nar Nebby, Nar Nar Narby. I love how Nebby has a charging station in its butt. Anyway. Hello. Up we go. <laughs> yeah, walked right past the receptionist. We know where we're off to. We know where we're off to. Which floor would you like to go to? Third floor, please. <laughs> I love chat. The scrub face, but pew pew. <laughs> With the gun? Goodness me. Hey there, honey. Yeah. Oh, hi. <laughs> no, she also has his voice. <laughs> this here's Professor Brene. She runs the Dimensional Research Lab. Yeah. And she's also my wife. You're a failure, right? Lily told me about you. <laughs> she said you were of a reliable sort. Three months ago, I found Lily lying on a beach. Yeah. Cosmog in her bag, also unconscious. Hmm? No how today? How? <laughs> the voice never ends. He's not doing his own thing. But he'll be, he'll be the real deal someday. He can even be a Kahama Kahuna. Become a Kahuna. Just like Olala before him. Yeah. You really think so? Whoa! Well, yeah, I really do. Good to see you again, Hal. It's been a while since I last saw you. Anyway, I brought failure here. Because I don't really know why. I just like seeing his weird looking smiley face like a robot everywhere I go. The mysteries of Alola, huh? Then you've got to mean the Ultra Werewolf! It's extremely rare, but something's a hole opens in the sky over Alola. It's actually pretty weird. You think, you, you know, we'd evacuate the area if beings from other dimensions literally just poured out of the sky, but now nah, we cool with it. The reasons that people think that it may be a mysterious dimension is because of the legends of a hole literally opening up, up in the sky. It happens every Tuesday. Pew! <laughs> Nevi, not you too! Nevi, don't you start with this stupid voice too! It's very weak as proof, but I can't ignore it. There's also plenty of evidence uh, already in the Pokedex for the existence of different Dimensions, right? I mean, actually, very true. Prince of Pokemon? Even normal wild Pokemon sometimes attack people, right? <laughs> but the Pokemon that appeared, the ultra. the words. They were called Ultra Beasts and they were feared. Yeah. If the stories are to be believed, the guardian deities of the islands fought desperately against them. Yeah. Well, like I said, it's all legends and folk tales. It's hard to know how much is true. Like, in the Pokedex, it even says that, like, Torchic is, like, 2,000 degrees or something. Can you believe that? Or uh, maybe it's Macargo. Anyway, you can find them on the bookshelves in this lab. Not the Macargo, but whatever I was talking about. Beautiful. Okay, you do you. You do you. You gently peel off the sticker. Just, like, punch a hole in the wall. Take out the plywood that was on the back of the sticker. This is mine now. <laughs> Beautiful. Can I, like, go on her computer? I, like, chill out. Oh, well, first of all, obvious red book. Let's see. All right. Well, I guess I can't read the obvious red book. So, are we done here? Uh, apparently not. I'm <laughs> being... <laughs> Dude. Kukui the body blocker. If I try to leave, he's just like, no. <laughs> you want to mess with a man of that bot, of that bot, of that build? That ain't happening. All right. Talk to me. Blah, 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 blah. You can find them on the bookshelves on this lab. I tried. The many writings on the... Okay. 
Can I help you? Oh, this book. Okay. Bronzong. What? This is an ultra world portal? Is it by opening portals to... It brought rains by opening portals to another world. Really? That's actually a clever entrance. Oh, Giratina, of course. Palkia, yeah? Interesting that we have Bronzong info in there. <laughs> Matang! Or Mang! What's up? Yes? What's happening? Do I have to keep reading? The main is about the Interdream Zone. Okay, yes. So this is just all a bunch of references to older Pokemon things. That's actually really cool. I like that connection. You wanted to know happened three months ago. Well, I'd want to learn more about Nebby. I mean, about Cosmog. Yeah. So I decided to come speak to Professor Brene. And once I started doing it, I started talking like her. It was kind of weird. I don't really know why. She listened to my story, stayed up all night to hear it all. She even got her husband, Poot. Professor Kukui, to lend me this, so this loft to stay in. Why? <laughs> and she told him, um, to help me investigate Nebby's origins, too. Yeah. Professor Brene has been so kind, and she's still trying to help me get Nebby back home. And help me fix my voice. I really don't know what's happened to me. Oh, she also just said she's been like a mother to me. Wow. Sad boys. Alright, so like, now what happens? Uh, what is this? Uh, I respect him. I respect him. Alright. So like... What is my progress? To po 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 po. We're going down here? I see Palkia. Some more bookshelves I'm not, I'm not getting? Can't do that. Can't do that. Can't do that. I'm out of room. Nebby. All right. Oh, right along. That's right. Here we go. Read the red slanted book. I'm attempting to. That was the first thing I tried to do. Rotto bargains. All right. Yeah, hack the cash register. I think that's actually a comic I read. All right. Right in front of it. I know there are many writings about it. Then you'll leave the house. I can't! I'm being body blocked by the man himself! Never mind. If Ultra Beast server. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Whoa! Alright, so now we're fighting Olivia. Now we're fighting Olivia. Good luck! Olivia's house is past Diglett's tunnel. It's in Cody Cody City. I still have some things I want to talk to Professor Panay about, so I'll stay here. Like how my voice still hasn't reverted back to what it once was. Alright. Now we're heading out. I believe now we also see the freaked out ultra wormhole. I wonder if there'll be like an extra cutscene. We're probably gonna see the ultra wormhole open up for a second, followed by like the new shining one or whatever people appear in. Dude. The road tunnel. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Let me blow this up for beautiful effect. Oh gosh! Oh no, it's happened to me too! It looked like a crack in the sky. What now? Hey, Feather! Three males, three, three cats, trials! You should meet going to Olivia. She lives in the town past Deacon's Tunnel. Deacon's Tunnel is, uh, let's see from here. It's kind of near the PMZ. It's easy to walk right past it, though. So keep your eyes peeled. No, it's well, a lot of time for me. Stop harassing the waiters. How? <laughs> I think he just walks in like, I oh, want like 15 muscle on his. <laughs> They're just like, oh no, he's back. Run. Close up shop. <laughs> they just see they just see him approaching from outside the Mausolata store area's window. It's like, ah! <laughs> Shut off the lights! Shut off the lights! Well, we're gonna be entering in a new area here. I'm excited, man. A brand new area. It's always a fun time. I think we're all stocked up on, on HP and healing items and such. So I think we're going to be feeling good like that. But. I'm excited. I love the table flip fail boat. <laughs> Run. Alright. Diglett's cave, huh? I won't lie. I'm a little nervous. We're, we're, we only have, honestly, three proper functioning Pokemon right now. 
We are close to getting Venom Shock for Nick. That I am I am eager for that. I am eager for that. We got 30 minutes left in this episode. We gotta make it count. New Pokemon time. Diglett? It could not be a Diglett. We could we have found other Pokemon here. It is indeed a Zubat. Well, this is our first Zubat. This counts as our first encounter. Looks like we're gonna be getting ourselves a Zubat. Let's do it. I'm fine with Zubats, man. I, I had an amazing Zubat beforehand. They did some great work. Alright. Bag it. Not the Pokeball. Please not the Pokeball. Give me a, that quick ball. Yo, people in chat are like a little bit like, oh boy, here we go. Zubats. No, man. Dude. Zubat is actually 10 out of 10. I've become a believer in the Zubat. Thanks to K. I'm actually 2,000% fine with this. Got him. Zubat will be added to the, to the Pokedex. Let me see some, uh, some info on them here. Registered. Let's see what their name is going to be in about a second here. All right, guys. Once, uh... Once slow mode goes on. Oh, actually, yeah. Once slow mode gets extended, the letters start. As soon as slow... Uh, we're going to do the fifth... Uh, no, let's do the tenth letter. Tenth letter I see once slow mode gets extended. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Purple Rowlet with the Z. Z. Now we're just gonna fix slow mode to make that back to three seconds instead of ten. Bam. There we go. Congratulations, Purple Rowlet. Let's do it. What are we going to name them? Z. Hmm. Z Nightmare. <laughs> Um, uh, no more letters, people. No more letters. Hmm. Zoom, zoom, zoom. No, no. Zoo. Oh gosh. Yeah, you know what? All caps, dude. What's their name? Zoom. I love it. All capitals. Zoom. <laughs> Send to box. Zoom. 10 out of 10. All right. Well, now that we know there are indeed Zubats in here, we can at least proceed with uh, understanding. Oh, that's right. We haven't really even seen the Aether Foundation at all yet. Hmm. Oh, failure, wasn't it? This game really is something, you know. It's overflowing with these Pokemon called Diglett, and they're getting really out of hand. Mediocre trainers can't even get through. So how's your island challenge going? Yeah, I'm, I'm ready to fight you now. I'm ready to fight you. You should be able to make it through this cave. Sounds good to me. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm eager and I'm ready. What if we, like, never encounter a Pokemon in my entire walk over? <laughs> we just keep on going like this the entire way. Just actual easy mode. I mean, so far, that seems to be the case. Our Aether Foundation, talk to me. I, are they good guys now? Music is still freaking me out a little bit. Let me turn up the music just a little bit. There we go. Wow, this music actually brings back a little bit of memories. Huh. All right. Well, I know you guys are good guys. Or at least you seem to be good guys. Before you weren't. But now you actually might be. I just realized we have three teams. We, we have three teams that are all like contrasting each other. We got the light bright people. We got skulls. And we got like nice people. Weird. All right. Vroom, vroom, zooms going for the moon. <laughs> all right. Well, side beam that one. Thank you, bump lid. The bump. Give him the bump. That's a good name, Bumpalid. I like that. We got 30 more minutes, pretty much. 25 more minutes before we switch over to our next game. 
before we switch over to bridge builder. Yeah, now we gotta focus on building some bridges of success, in my opinion. I really hope I never encounter a diglet. It's like, the diglet in this cave won't let anyone through who isn't strong enough. We fight exclusively Zubat for five minutes. All right, let's do it. Did you just say the force doesn't go well? Apparently. Goodness me. Worker Vaklov. Let's do it, man. It says me making until. That's right, we're actually doing four games. I forgot to update it. We're doing four games today. Two 30 minute segments in the upcoming thing. I'll update that later. For now, I do want to focus real fast because this Pokemon is not. I'm not astute to this Pokemon. It's rock and flying. So I have caution. But right now, it's. Yeah, it seems like Bumpelade will just, you know, one shot it. That works with me. How's everyone else doing? No, no levels? We need more levels. We need some more levels ASAP, man. That's all right. What's happening here? Whoa! Whoa, I actually just fight these guys. Okay. Interesting. I actually didn't fight any Diglett yet. So, uh, we're just going to proceed on here. Failure! Ooh, double battle? I'm down. I'm down. It's Team Skull. That's right. You want some? That's how we say hello. Nice knowing you, you punks. No, no rhyme? No beat? I was ready. I timed that. I timed that wording so that way I could humor you for if you guys actually laid something down. But, uh, it did not end up working out because you guys are bad. What a great game of Splatoon 2 you're playing, Failboat. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Kyan. Kyan and Peppa. Alright, interesting. A weird duo. Dude, go bump a lid. Make quick work of them. Ooh, Eevee. Very nice. Also, does that show that how is three Pokemon? I'm not sure. Dude, Psybeam? Either one. Do kill the Salandit. The Salandit scares me the most, frankly. There we go. That one has some interesting mechanics to it. I would not rather deal with. The Ekans? We'll deal with that, like, now. Yes, JoJo grew a level! Potential for evolution. Ha! <laughs> Biting battles. Let's go. Bite fight. Yeah, just give him the Psybeam. Give it to him, Bumbleid. Feel about you missed a Pokeball, you could have had an item. I, I saw, but I really didn't care. It wasn't a TM, so I just moved on. I love that. This random guy. I love that emoticon. There we go. Double beat. Double beat. Why do you have a Salandit? I mean, only because, like, that one scared me. I don't like Salandits. Uh, I mean, facing them, rather. They have a lot of interesting things that I would rather not deal with. Fire and poison? That's pretty dangerous, if you ask me. That's pretty dangerous. What is this? Oh, Max Ether. Thank you very much. Better than a revive, frankly. I can actually use ethers. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Let's see if I can still get here without encountering... <gasps> we got through Diglett's cave without encountering a Diglett. <laughs> Feels funny, man. Feels good. <gasps> How did he talk? Wait. This is an Annabelle. How did he talk? I remember Annabelle. Annabelle! How did he talk? He talked like really... He, I remember he was like really tiring to talk like. How did he talk like? I forget. People in chat are saying panic. I don't know. I'm only panicking about his, his voice speech. I don't remember. I'm just gonna go with it. I'm, I'm gonna. <laughs> well, I know what to give him. Worker is my name. I travel the world. Many lands do I visit for. For my own private reasons. Yeah. I've been hanging out with the new professor around here. He's like pretty cool. I don't know why, but I just started talking like him all of a sudden. It's a little weird. The concerns I have about those reports sightings of the infamous Pokemon Mafia. Oh, forgive me for keeping you. I give you this Thunderstone. If you forgive my rudeness. Yeah. I brought three without thinking. Can I get a Moonstone instead, though? A Moonstone. Do you have a good adventure, my trial-going young friend? Or do have one, rather. Beautiful. <laughs> Good cover. Oh! Oh! Ah! I surrender! 
I surrender. I mean nothing wrong. I'm being pulled over. Oh, God, he's running at me. Go, go, go. Goodness me. All right, Herdier. Do what I love, Herdier. They were adorable. All right, all right. Bumpalid. Kill the doggo. <laughs> I love that emoticon in chat from Roxio there. Or Moxio, rather. Like, he's actually running at me like that. Like, aha! Dude, give it to him, man. Give him the side beam. <gasps> the confusion! Looks like a dog. It's probably because it is one. Take down. Ew, not loving that. Not in love with it, frankly. Really not in love with that. That's okay. Give it to him again. Another laser beam. It's a beautiful day. I will heal up before I do anything else. I'm playing this super safe, man. Look, we only have like three actual fighting capable Pokemon. Jojo, potentially. Camel and, and Booyah, I'd really rather not use right now. Right now, I want to focus on um, keeping who we can alive. Without anything going wrong, frankly. Diddle is useless for Nuzlocke? I wouldn't say that. I just think they're tougher to use in Nuzlocke. Okay. Oh, 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 I'm a stupid. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm a super stupid. I'm actually not the stupidest stupid. Because I have my charger right below me. Bam, I thought ahead. Let's see, man. I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> I love the karate guy running in the background. Just like, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Just like screaming while running down the road. Doppler effect and everything. Just like, ah! All right. Give it to me. You already know what I'm going for. You already know what I'm going for. Ba-bam. Ba-bam. What? Oh, it's 10,000. Never mind. I am poor now. We already know what I'm going for. Frame one purchase. Give it to me. Nick, you are powered up. Get in there. This is Venoshock. A powerful move. We will overlap it. Overlap Poison Sting for it. Yes, we will overlap Poison Sting for it. I'm loving it, man. I am loving it. Um, anyone else we should give this to? I mean, might as well give this to Booyah. Dan, Nick is a physical attacker. Yeah, but it's still important in my eyes. <gasps> Booyah has toxic spikes. Please and thank you. Also, go to the police station. Will I get, like, a ticket if I don't? Grass knot? Hold on. You know what? You know what? Bump a lid. Is this worth you having? Let me just, like, is this a physical move or is it a special move? It is special. However, its power is dependent upon the weight. Um, I, I don't think I should. Reflect may be useful. Is Mimic ever going to be useful, Real Talk? Is Mimic ever going to be useful? Like, I'm ready to change out Mim Mimic like, at any time here. How powerful is Rock Tomb? Rock Tomb for coverage on Nick? No, because we already have everything else. Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. Because, yeah, Swallow and Stockpile, I think, might be useful. Might be useful. Actually, are, are Stockpile and Swallow going to actually be useful? Because it will just take multiple turns, turns to, sweat, to like set up a Stockpile before Swallow is actually, actually useful. I don't think it's very good to have, frankly. Maybe I can give it to Camel. Let's see. Camel. You got this. Going to be good. Wait, hold on. Is this good? This increases the... Oh, no. I don't need this. This is stupid. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Booty boop. I'm, I'm liking what we got. Keep crunch? Of course. I have no, I have no intention of getting rid of crunch of all things. <gasps> Wait a minute. Hold on. 
Is this the massage thing? Is this the massage thing? Wait a minute. Doesn't this increase friendliness or something? Yes. Hey, Jojo. Wait, no, 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 no. I want everyone to get a massage, but look. Jojo, you're looking a bit stressed. You're looking a bit stressed. Have a massage, Jojo. Be easy on them. They're like a balloon. The potential is real right now. The potential is real. Okay, okay. Now. Bumble it front and center. Do the Rotto Lotto. Then. I guess we go to the police station? I've been told to go there. I'm okay with that. Is this catch rate? Or not catch rate, uh, catching thing? Encounter! Oh, I'm fine with that. How about that police station? On it, on it, on it. I see you, chat. I see you, chat. Oh, it's probably because Nanu. Oh, it's totally Nanu, isn't it? It's totally Nanu. It's totally Nanu. Nothing yet. Hello? D d Ditto! What? Wait, what? Ditto? This is why you guys were talking about Ditto! Oh, this is weird. Wait, wait, wait! Hold on! What if I mimic transform? The game just crashes. It'll probably be something extremely underwhelming. Give him the quick ball. Ditto? It doesn't have limber, unfortunate. Unfortunately, rather. That's unfortunate. Uh, okay. Oh, God. Ah, oh, this is a strange fascination. They're, like, just saying a hi to one another. So what if I mimic? <laughs> Seems pointless. Just side beam it, I guess? It shouldn't kill it. Yeah, it is, it is my typing now. Can I throw a Pokeball at the substitute? I'm very confused. It tries to substitute again. Okay. I, I guess I keep side-beaming it. This is a weird battle. Alright. Substitute is faded. Used Reflect. This is strange. Yo, real talk for the funniness of it. Mimic it. But it failed. Okay, of course it failed because we already have that move. Ow! This is weird. Okay. Ultra ball. I want to get like another hit on it. I want to get into the orange. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it used Mimic, but it failed. It's coming from the Pokemon that has perfectly mimicked my Pokemon. How many Great Balls do I have? Yeah, Great Ball. I like to try and keep at least one of every ball. Unless, you know, just in case I need it. One? Nope, that's unfortunate. All right. Another one. Another shot. Beautiful. I could potentially give it one more shot. I don't want to do it, though. I don't want to do it. I'd rather just go for it. We, have, we should buy more Ultra Balls. Yo, chat, remind me to buy Ultra Balls. When we, go, when we next go to a Pokemon Center. We need to take care of that. Eh? There we go. There we go. How about that? Ditto was caught. Weird. And because of that, millions of, of people will die. Why? Because we just took an officer off the case. This Ditto, despite it being a Ditto, was actually the best officer on the force. They never talked, 
but they solved every crime with extreme efficiency. This is the crime fighting ditto. No longer serving the public, now serving my team. Name it Smash 4. Stop this. Alright, once 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 the thing once the slow mode goes live. Then uh then the letters go live. Let's do the fourth letter. The fourth letter. Something something lower than than super things. Here we go, the fourth letter. One, two, three. The next one! Four! Four! Pig pig S, that's it! No more! Pig pig S. Beautiful. Beautiful. Um. Hmm. C. Secret. Secret. Sea crack? Sea crack! What is that name? I love it. Private Eye Sea Crack. What? A Ditto was disguised as my partner! Are the Ditto 5 responsible for this? The Ditto 5 love humans so much that they transform into humans. They are very troublesome. They mean no harm. But they mess up people's relationships, so they are... Tr what happened to your partner? Wait, oh, here we go. Oh, never mind, the partner's actually fine. <laughs> the partner has been brutally murdered. <clears throat> Thank you for finding out that a ditto was disguised as my partner. Take this as thanks. Heavy compensation. Did he just bribe money? Was that bribe money? Just like, look, don't talk about how we let a ditto into our police unit. Here's t here's twelve thousand dollars. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Thank you. Well, neat. Um, twelve thousand dollar dollars. I mean, that's actually like in nor in normal money terms, like a hundred and twenty bucks. The dude just gave me straight up 120 bucks for finding out that his partner was, you know, was that. Actually, what? <laughs> did, did, ditto! Not you too, Nurse Joy! <laughs> you have to kill Nurse Joy now? Then only on, on her deathbed, in the last shriveler shiver of life she has left, she was like, I was just kidding, I'm not actually a ditto. And she just dies. Hey there, guy! <laughs> Don't mind me talking about the death of people. Thank you for the rare candy. I appreciate it. I'll probably not use it, but, you know, who knows? Moo Moo Milk? Yes, thank you. All right, man. I'm excited. I'm excited. This is a brand new area. Moo Moo Milk. Neato. Give me those beans, too. I really need beans. Goodness me. What time is it right now? Anything we could do of immediate importance. Like, short-term immediate importance. Like a fast cut scene. Oh! Thank you, chat, for reminding me to buy Ultra Balls. Is there anything we could, like, purchase real fast? Or not purchase, or like, or like tend to real fast here? Just blow all my money. I'm buying Ultra Balls. Perfect. Catch a new Pokemon. Can we do that? I'll totally catch a uh, new Pokemon right now. Revives? <laughs> no. If there's a new Pokemon to be caught, yeah, let's 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 do that real fast. I I no, I totally can catch Pokemon over here. Because the Pokemon I caught necessarily wasn't in the route because he was uh in the police station. So it's actually fine for me to catch new Pokemon over here. Although I do believe this is a new area. Let's catch a new Pokemon over here. Memorial Hill. 
Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no. This is the super sad boys area. I'm okay with that, though. Let's quickly run through here. Catch ourselves a new Pokemon that is the eyes of another human. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. We can make this real fast. What is that? What is that? Oh, they're getting stronger, man. They are getting stronger. Oh, jeez. Catch the human. I'm worried that they're getting stronger, man. Is this thing of a different typing, or is it just aesthetic changes? I think it's just aesthetic changes. I also don't want to hit it with physical moves, because I believe it has that thick fur. The extra thick fur. Yeah, there we go. Two laser beams is all we need. <laughs> it's Mr. Meme. <laughs> it's Mr. Meme. <laughs> Why did we never make that connection? Why did we never make that connection? It's Mr. Meme. Bumble, it is Mr. Meme. Comfy? Yeah, I'm okay with this. Mr. Meme! I love it. Mr. Meme. How did we never think of that? Who said that in chat? What is this? Ah! Oh, I hate that. But I'm also not, like, at a low enough HP to care just yet. Get in there, Bumble -Lid. Yes, Bumble -Lid! Mr. Meme! Mr. Meme! That's the good stuff, Bumble -Lid. That is the good stuff. Is it ghost type after all? Because <laughs> it's dead now. All right. Let's catch ourselves a new Pokemon. Um, should we have Bumpalid Mr. Meme up in front? I do not think so. Um, who's a good Pokemon to handle this? Would you kill it? Jojo wouldn't kill it, but they also probably couldn't hit it. Venom Shock would probably kill it. I don't want to use Camel or Booyah. They might be stronger now. Also a Mimic. Yo, Bumbling might be able to use Mimic to, mimic to kill it. Let's go with that. Let's, let's, let's use Bumbling. I'm not going to change his name to Mr. Meme. That's a nickname, if anything. Sometimes we nickname our nicknames. Bumbling, a.k.a. Mr. Meme. Oh, a Ghastly. Okay, okay, I'm down with that. It's simple. It's simple. I'm fine with this. First of all, Bag. Now, give me that quick ball. If this can go over with a quick ball, I'll be really happy. Hmm. One, two, three. Spherical. It's perfect. Wait, you already catch it? I don't think so. You already have one? Do I already have a Gengar? Or a Ghastly? You already have a Ghastly? Oh, we will release that one! <laughs> no nickname! We will release this Ghastly! We will release that one back into the wild. Whoopsie! Sorry, you catch so many Pokemon in so many runs and you kind of forget sometimes. Where did we catch a Ghastly? What? When did we catch a Ghastly? Oh, wasn't it the other haunted area? You are right. It was at the other haunted area. No, you are indeed correct. Well, in the meantime, Psybeam. I mean, by normal rules, that should be your encounter. I mean, but we already have one, so I... You see the gray Pokeball. Yeah, I see, I normally look for that, but I just, I was just like, okay, whatever. I think it's fine if we catch another one. I, I you know, I, I don't think it's, it's going to matter too much. If anything, it's my penalty. I lose a quick ball because of it. 
Well, I see we're gonna get a lot of those. Here I was trying to end the stream nice and easily. That's okay, we can go about five minutes over. Dude, I'm excited. After this, we got bridge building followed by, um... We got bridge building followed by me making. I'm ready for that. Plus, we have a chance to evolve JoJo in a second. That's also what I'm hoping for. Oh my gosh. Speak of the devil. Please. It is time. It's time. I've been waiting for this evolution for so long. JoJo has reached the level they need to evolve. Your JoJo has evolved into Jigglypuff. JoJo! The songs they sing are totally different depending on the region they live in. Some even sound like they're shouting. Jo -jo! Dude, this, <laughs> this Jigglypuff only exclusively sings JoJo vocals. Sono Chino Sarame! Dude, we need a Moonstone still. We're still in need of a Moonstone. They need more power. They need more power. <laughs> right now, for level 31, that level of attack is not enough. We need JoJo to get even stronger. Because right now, they are still weak. That is amazing, though. A Moonstone. We evolved them using a Moonstone. Goodness me. Do you really want to evolve JoJo, though? Yes and no. Like, sure, having a shiny Jigglypuff is like 10 out of 10. Wait a minute. Go to the shop in the city. <gasps> There's no way. We'll come back here for another new Pokemon later. This is important to me. This is important to me. This is important to me. First of all, yoink. Hello. I understand why people were telling me to go there. I now get it. I now get it. Is there any le- Oh, but first of all. Is there any move we should be trying to teach JoJo before we make them into a Wigglytuff? Bumblet is looking at you with intense and burning passion. Dude, Bumblet, Mr. Meme, get in there. Is there any move that we should we should hold out on? What I'm actually probably going to do, I'm not, I'm going, if I can get a Moonstone, I won't use it yet. Yes, Bumbalid with the Clutch Dodge. Good stuff, Bumbalid. Yes, I am fighting a preschooler in a cemetery. What of it? You can go to the shop to fight the rock trial. All right, so it looks like we won't be going to the shop yet. Ooh, actually good? Hold up. This is actually incredible. Actually incredible. This this move functions as like recover, right? Because if, if they eat a citrus berry, they can just use the citrus berry again. I think this is amazing. Do we need Mimic? The user copies the target's last move. The move can be switched out. This does not seem that great. Situationally, maybe it could work. 
But frankly, I don't think we need Mimic. Compared to Substitute, Psybeam, and Reflect. We're gonna get rid of Mimic. This actually might be incredible. And Booyah got a level. Let's go. Don't say you're getting sleepy when you're standing in a graveyard. <laughs> sounds like, sounds like a, a bad message. You're just gonna pass out on the spot, keel over, and there you go. All right, we'll return to that area later to catch a new Pokemon. Let, let's let's do a couple. Let's do a couple things. Let's do a couple things real fast here. First of all, we head over here. Second of all, we heal up. Next up. Next up. Get everyone all healed in that nice little pattern. That's actually a 10 out of 10 pattern. All you need to get is body slam at level 32. Sounds good to me. Next up. Well, first of all, first of all. Ghastly, my apologies. Return to the wild from whence you came. This is the right Ghastly, right? Yes. Return from whence you came. It was a Levitate Ghastly. Ours is not Levitate, right? Oh, no, ours is Levitate. That's actually pretty nice. Next up, meet the new team. We have a new team here. We have uh, Team Zoom and Seacrack. As well as Clam and Waifu, Choi and Yeet, Udala and Koila, Wooper, K, 707, aka Tot, Salmon, and Paf and Pupla. Dude, I'm liking these team comps. I'm really liking these team comps. Plus, we got JoJo. Yes. Yes. Well, what's going to happen? Real fast, we are going to do a quick save. We're going to pet our Pokemon. And then we're going to end it here for today. That being said, if you're watching this live, don't go anywhere. Because after we pet our Pokemon and do everything I just said, we will be back with some bridge building followed up by me making. In one of the weirdest segments I've ever done on the channel. Bump the lid, Mr. Meme. You have done some work today. You have done some work today. And we're only going to see that power increase as we go on. Thank you for their thank you for your dedication and for your work. Mr. Meme. <laughs> I love that, man. Mr. Meme. All right. Beautiful. Eat up. Is it the sponsor game? We have not decided the, the sponsor game yet. I, I still have to figure out how that's going to work. I'm excited, though. Change JoJo picture? I'll do that at the beginning of the next episode. Or I'll do that in between episodes, rather. Mr. Meme. There we go. We've beaten Pokemons. Evolving all the time. Even if we take a nap... It was still easy clap. That does not rhyme, but I see what you were getting at. And I appreciate the the edits on the copy pasta. Wait, sponsor game when? Not sure yet. I need to work out the details. But I highly recommend, uh, if you guys are sponsors, or if you guys even aren't sponsors, head on over to the Failboat Discord. Because that's where I'm going to like keep things keep you guys informed on things. Head over to the Fanboat Discord and specifically keep an eye on the Lifeboat Room. If you're a sponsor, keep an, keep an eye on the Lifeboat Room. Because that's where I'll be updating you guys on the state of things. I'm also, I'm also so excited for bridge building in meme time. Or me time, me making rather. It's been a while. Whoa, Black Friday! Extra happy! Very nice! We need as much happiness as possible. Happiness is delightful. There we go. 
Black Friday. JoJo's stand. It's a you're a powerful creature. A very powerful creature. Cash, you indeed can vote. I think. Cash, if you are currently a lifeboat, aka sponsor, or, or a Twitch sub, then it's fine. But that has to be currently. Um, JoJo. Hello, JoJo. Look at you. You are adorable. Oh, you don't like pink pet in the ears. <gasps> this is adorable. I just want to see this. Aw, dude, sad JoJo. It's adorable. It's adorable. Yo, can I get a high five? High five? High five? <gasps> yes! <laughs> Feels fantastic, man. Feels fantastic, man. Adorable. Adorable. All right. Eat up a little bit, JoJo. Eat up. There we go. My Simi Sage's name, JoJo? Now, that actually is, like, a very fitting one. <clears throat> Slow eating. The tiny stubs are so cute. They are adorable. All right, JoJo. Good luck in the future. We're going to get you super strong in a little bit. Hopefully. Now, what else needs to be looked at here? Nick! Nick! Also, extremely powerful. Currently, extremely powerful. Covering the map, even if we take a nap, it was still easy clap. Did you enjoy my haiku? You've just removed one of the lines from the normal copy pasta. I can't say I love it. I'll be honest. Ooh! <gasps> Our first five happiness! Wow! Nick with the full happiness! We gotta be using Nick a good bit more, man. I'm excited to have them at, at max happiness. We gotta give it to them, man. We gotta, we gotta make sure they're uh, used and loved here. Actually, that being said, real fast, Bumbleid, let me just pet you one more time here. Oh, sorry, Bumbleid, didn't mean to put you to sleep. Bumbleid was like, all right, you already pet me, we're moving on. Let me pet you a little bit more. See if I can get the note to appear. To make sure, yeah, okay, okay, okay. Now we're good, now we're good. I just wanted to see if we could get them to max happiness. We could not do that. Booyah! I don't believe we pet you before. What's going on, Booyah? Are you like... You like being pet there. Are you poisonous at all? Hold on, what if I pet your tentacle? You don't mind that, you like that. How about your weird like, crown thing you got going on there? Well, whatever this is. You really like the gem. You like being pet on the gem. You're petting his hands. Huh. Yeah? Not wrong. Well, I mean, now you're wrong. There we go. Beautiful. Also, how do you eat? Oh. I wasn't sure if I just had to hold it under them. <laughs> Let the underneath mouth take care of it. Do we need more Pokemon beans so badly? There we go. There we go. All right. Now is this pet camel, and then we're gonna hop on over to the next game. This has been like a very good episode. Consume. It's been like a very good episode. Camel. What's up? What do you like, game pet? Oh, I love it. I love the noise. Oh no! They didn't like that! I'm sorry. Found it! I found a sweet spot! Look at the eyes! 
Look at the eyes, man. It's adorable. They like having their hair rustled. Where's the ears? Do you like ears? No. It's hair. Or maybe it's just the tuft in the middle. No, it's forehead. It's the weirdest sweet spot, man. I think I got it, though. I think I got it, though. Yeah, right there. Perfect. Well, Camel, thank you for your work thus far. You have not done too much work. You have not been in a battle. No worries. You will get your time to shine. I promise you. All right. Now. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for watching. Tune in next time for whatever I feel like doing. This has been the Pokemon segment of In the Meantime. Don't go anywhere. We still have one more hour left of In the Meantime. My team. Bumpily, Black Friday, Nick, Camel, Booyah, and JoJo. I'm liking what we got going on. So, thank you all for watching. Tune in next time for whatever I feel like doing. And I'll see you around. Don't go anywhere if you're watching this live. We'll be right back with more in the meantime. I just want to look like dead in the center. Beautiful. And I'll see you around. Alola.